there guys, Billabo10000 here, bringing you the third episode of Titan Souls. In this episode, we're going to be taking on the three enemies in this lovely lava-filled kingdom of death. Starting with this guy. The big thing to know about this guy is, well, he's got a bunch of spiky balls and he can hit you with them, and you don't want that. He also does this little spinny attack when he gets upset. And he was that easy. What? First time? I was expecting to die. I was expecting him to be the wrong way around or what? 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 Okay, I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. I can take this. That's fine. I'm not gonna complain. I ain't gonna complain about this shit. No, this is a good fucking thing. Go there. No, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. I swear I'm not complaining. Okay. Take you. Back on there. Wow, okay. Alright, let's let's go to the second titan in the area that Oh my god. Is this fucking thing? This guy, very frustrating. Basically, we control where he goes. Nope. And we need to make him line up in one of those bombs, and basically it causes explosions and it's fun. Oh, close. No, 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 no. I didn't want him over there. This is not an optimal bo- Ow! Not an optimal bomb placement. The bomb is basically shot at you in the trajectory close to where you are standing when he launches the bomb, so you sort of have to maneuver it and make sure it's sort of in the middle. That's sort of how I'm getting a feeling of this. It's a difficult boss battle though. Definitely much more difficult than your standard fight. Oh, I, I didn't dodge diagonally, I dodged left and, you know, I burned myself! It's like friggin' Icarus, the wings of Icarus. I'm burning myself as I fly too close to the sun. Was that Icarus? I don't know, I think it was Icarus. Fire over here, please. Thank you. It does get to a point where you sort of have to just randomly hope for the best. Alright, let's try and lead him around a bit. <laughs> okay. There we go. I, I went very quiet there because I was in full on try hard mode, but we have the point, we have the soul. So that's basically what you do. You pull them into the bomb, you retrieve your arrow as quickly as you can and you shoot. You only have a few seconds to do that and I have no idea how I did that that time. Also, I'm very loud, I'm peeking my microphone, I apologize. How did I do that? How the fuck have I- I've killed two fucking titans in four minutes, and in the test run that I did of- of these titans on my other save, it took me way longer. I mean, I didn't even fucking kill that guy. Um, excuse me. Thank you. I've only got one more to kill, though, but I would argue this one is probably the most tricky one. It's pretty obvious where to hit him, but... Aside from that, he's a surprisingly-
can't do this. <laughs> I killed all three of them in five minutes, for fuck's sake. Fuck, they were meant to last me all episode. I haven't tested against any of the others yet. Fuck. Oh my god, that was, um, that was fucking glorious. What's in here? Where's this go? Oh, what's this? It's an elevator, okay. I'll take it, let's go, where are we going? I don't know. Oh, I think we're in the snow area, actually. I think I know where we are. Woo, 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 woo. We're in the snow area. Oh, wow. Wow, okay. That was pretty amazing. Uh, we're in the snow area, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the easiest boss in this area that I haven't faced before, but I sort of know the logistics to his fight. We're gonna be facing Stratus. Child of the Earth and Sun, I believe he's called. Ow. Effectively, what you need to do is you need to let those icicles hit his teeth. No, 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 why? Why? What? Okay. I'm done with the whole laughing thing. I'm done with the whole laughing thing. Can we just go, please? I will say that is, uh, that is the, um... That is the funniest shit I have ever done in my life. I... I did a test run of those fights, and I couldn't even uh, defeat the, the slime one or the boulder one. I beat the mace guy in my test run, but I couldn't beat the others, and then to just sort of beat them all in one quick go, it, um, it slightly broke me a little bit. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Damn it! That's really difficult to move. Also, the blood. Ew. Don't like blood. I like how this checkpoint is right by the fight, though. So you can literally just climb up these stairs and you're there. Like, it's it's much quicker than any of the other fights to get to, which is cool. Nope, that one was a miss. Oh, close. Am I getting slowed down by the... S oh, they kill me. Didn't realize that. Did not realize that. I'm also really bad at aiming at the teeth. God damn it. Come on, we can do this. Let's get a fourth uh, enemy kill. Then I'm going to actually explore this area a bit because there's a lot of places that I can go. Like, ignoring the bosses, there's actually a lot of little areas that, like, look explorable. And I want to kind of explore them. There we go. Now I have to shoot the teeth where the, th where the enemy is, but I got killed, so you know. But basically that's what you do. You break the teeth and then you shoot the pink behind the teeth, and if you can shoot the pink behind the teeth, you win. Arguably, this is meant to be one of the easier bosses. I would say it is pretty easy. It's just a case of getting to grips with the slowness that can sometimes happen in this arena. That knocked me down. I can't get... Got it. Okay, that's fine. You can just do what you want. That's fine. Keep moving. There we go. Stratus is dead. Stratus, child of the earth and sky is dead. That's his title. I remember his title because it's weird. Also his eyes, his poor eyes, they're like, like one of them's slightly higher than the other, so it seems like he genuinely has just been like shot and killed. Which he has, but you know, it seems a bit more brutal than it actually is. How the fuck am I already here? I thought it would take me so much longer to beat that first level. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, ignoring this, I'm just gonna unlock 
the way to the next uh, guy. I also am going to light every single torch in this area because I feel like there has got to be some sort of achievement for it. Okay, come on. Let me throw it. Let me throw it. Okay. Whee! Basically, we need to unfreeze this little area over here. But I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna be struggling a bit because you sort of need the gamepad to really unlock it. Otherwise, your arrow sort of goes in a direction. God damn it! See, like I get very close and then I miss. It's a little bit frustrating for obvious reasons. There we go. So that's going to lead us to one boss, but we're not going to go there yet. I I want to actually want to see. Can I bu can I burn that down there? No, that's that's unburnable. I'm going to see if I can light up the rest of the torches at least see if that does anything. I'm not sure if it does, but uh, I'd like to think it does. That'd be kind of cool. Although to be fair, I have no idea how I'd end up getting that torch up there lit so I think it's I think it's safe to say that it's either not possible or just not supposed to be possible but this music can I just appreciate can we appreciate the music that goes into this area it's it's actually quite I would say haunting in its brilliance like it just sounds so quiet this is a way back to the main area of the world that way we'll take you back down to the sanctuary where we started our journey. It's pretty cool. I've let you. It's just, you know. I wonder if I can melt these snow buffs. Mm. No? Alright. Come on. Out you come. Ow. Like, there's this little pathway that you could climb, I think. But I don't really know how you would. I feel like there's got to be a way to climb it, and then you can go around, and you can go around here, and... I don't know why you'd want to, but... It seems like there is just a pathway there, and I want to sort of know how to get onto it. Maybe you can burn these things with the... Hmm. Well, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm just going to quickly take a short break, and I'm going to come back if I figure out what you need to do to break those snow buffs. If there isn't exactly a way to break them, that's perfectly fine. I can live with that. We'll see what happens. So I'll see you guys in a moment. <laughs> 